What's going on? This is Legend of All About the Kicks. Put a like on that button. Share this to your friends and family, man. Put a like on that button. But anyway, we talk about Chicago, man. We talk about FBG Duck. That's my man, son. The boy's a beast. You know, drill rapper. Rest in peace to him. You know, he got shot in, in, a, in a good neighborhood. But the people who shot him and King Von and all of them, they had a they had a 50,000 on his head, man. And they testing each other with the bull jack. Y'all people crazy. Yo, y'all understand how you get caught these days? You get caught. If you kill somebody, the first thing police do is look at your phone. They look at your your tracking. They look at your text messages. They look at your phone numbers. That's how these dudes get caught. If you're going to do a murder, and I'm not telling nobody to do a murder, but if you're trying to do a murder, leave your cell phone home, man. Or get you a burner phone because... When they track you and that satellite hit your phone, it's going to show them everywhere you've been. Everywhere you've been. So you got to be careful. If you're trying to do something like that, you got to understand. No testing. No phone calls. And no tracking. And a lot of these dudes get caught like that. You know, I watch a lot of uh, videos of murder and all that. You know what I mean? I just watch it. You know what I'm saying? It's crazy how these dudes get caught. And 99.9% they get caught just with a cell phone. They check their cell phone. They check their cell phone records. They check the text messages. The last text. The last person you call. So, like I said, y'all deserve to go to jail because y'all dumb. You stupid. You're testing each other like little kids and stuff. Yeah, I got him right here. 50 on his head. Like, yeah, okay. You got 50 on his head. You could have just went and met some met to do something. Like, only I do call him. Like, yo, meet me here. And talk about it on the street. Don't talk about it on the phone. I know it's more easier to do it on the phone because you don't have time to be filing, finding dudes or... But still, if you're trying to do something, man, you got to plan it right, man. You can't do no sloppy job, man. And that's how these dudes get caught, man, because they do stupid shit. They do dumb stuff. They they sloppy with it. They don't understand that the police, they, they on social media, they on Facebook, they on Instagram. They they track your phone. And, and when they track your phone, that's you're guilty. You're going to jail. There's nothing you can do about it. That phone tells everything. But fb duckman salute to him man he was a dope rapper you know what i'm saying he did wish that death on other rappers and dead people um ops and all that and most of the time when you talk about other people it can happen to you so you got to be careful when you when you do stuff man. you know what i'm saying people just don't understand that like when you talk about people man make sure you sure you can handle that pressure because if you can't something can happen to you next topic let's go like ice spice i mean she's okay she just don't have the personality to to go with the rap shit. That's just my opinion. She's a beautiful girl. I think she's beautiful. I'm not even saying that. I, I, I think she's cute. But I don't think she's going to be around that long. Not like she's going to disappear. But I think she should do, to me, I think she do OnlyFans. That'd be good for her, man. She could shake a booty, make money, maybe make 10000 a week. You know what I'm saying? 20000 a week. Because people are going to go see her. You know what I'm saying? she got a beautiful body. So she need to do OnlyFans, man. Because I, I just don't feel like she... I'm, I'm not going to... About her raw, cause you know she could find some ghost writers, and I don't know. I guess I don't know if she write her music or not. You know what I'm saying? I, I'm not. I don't know. You know what I'm saying? I never checked the credits, or none of that. But she do got ghost writers. Like you better tell your boys to you know write you some more hits because that song is gonna go so far, man. People only know you for one song or two songs, and you won't come up with something else. They'll forget about you. They'll see you in the street, want your autograph, or take pictures, but they're gonna be like, oh, she fell off. So we'll see, man. We'll see. Like I said, she's a beautiful girl, but I think she should go into OnlyFans. It's just my opinion. You know what I'm saying? If you agree with me, you think she's going to be around. Like I said, she's popping. You know what I'm saying? Her Instagram popping. Her, her Facebook is popping. Her Instagram, you know, Snapchat, all that stuff popping. So that's all good. You can make money off that too. But like I said, OnlyFans, she can start, make, charge $15 a month. And people going to see it, man. These young kids want to see her. So that's just my opinion. You know what I'm saying? Um... It is what it is, you know what I'm saying? But anyway, but subscribe to the channel, man. Put a like on the button. If you like Ice Spice, put a comment. You think she's going to be around for a long time? Let me know. But Gorilla, who signed to uh, Gotti, she's going to be around for a long time. She got bars. She can spit. I like her flow. Um, she got the personality. She got the. She just got it all. Gorilla got it all, man. Platinum singles. Two or three of them won awards already. You, you know, Ice Spice came out like the same time she came out, but she just blew up maybe a couple months before her. So, anyway, we got to the channel, put a like and a button. We out of here. Deuces. One love.